Hey gang, it's Ark. So I've decided that it is long since time that I learn Hush River Valley. Um, so this is going to be a one region challenge and I'm going to be playing in Stalker for um, a couple of reasons. Um, I'll try to talk more about that in a minute. But for right now, let's get into the game. And we won't be using any feats this run. Okay, so the last few runs I've done have all been in Interloper. It's like we are starting in a cave here. Um, and we've been learning the maps. And I've run into some problems with Interloper. Um... And it's weird because it's not that the, that it's too hard, it's more that it's too annoying or irritating. I'm not sure exactly what the right word is. Uh, but so, just for example, not having access to the bedroll um, means that I sometimes have to travel a really long way just to get back to somewhere where I can sleep. Um, and in particular, in my latest series, the blind Blackrock one, um, I noticed that it would get to the point where I would spawn, and then I would have to spend a lot of time just getting established with the regions that I already knew something about. Alright, let's see. It is... Oh, it's... Basically nighttime. This is um, not great. Should probably just gather as much firewood as I possibly can. Uh, let's try not to lose track of this cave. And let's see. Can I see where the sun is? Apparently not very well. Alright, well I'm going to do some running. Um... I probably want to tire myself out as quickly as possible. Um, so the reason I'm doing Stalker instead of a hybrid is I don't really want to play in custom because I'm fairly close to unlocking the cold fusion feet and so I would prefer to play in a mode where I earn feet progress all right so we sort of have a giant wall behind me here so I follow that with the wall on my right to get back to that cave Fortunately, there is a lot of fuel here. <sighs> I think it's about six sticks per hour. For the fire. So, if I get 60 sticks, that should be more than enough. Probably won't need the fire to go for a full 10 hours. Let's take a look in a minute and see. Um, I can't feel my hands. See how many I have so far. This is probably going to be the most pressure we'll be under. Um, ordinarily, I'd have 
a lot longer to get the fuel I need for the night. Main reason I'm collecting these is, um... I am not at all tired yet, so I'm probably going to be looking for a few additional tasks to perform. Do I, if I don't see, I don't about have frostbite so... risk. Actually, in Stalker, you might start with a hat and gloves. Now that I think about it. Alright, well we know this area is safe because of the deer. Let's see, we got some cattails here. That'll be tender for tonight. Possibly my food as well. Oh, and I don't know if I mentioned this, but of course this is uh, essentially completely blind. Um, I don't... I've spawned in here in interloper once or twice but that was a while ago and um i never really found anything so that usually involved just i would wander around for a few hours and then freeze to death but in stalker of course we spawn with matches so that's hopefully going to make a big difference minutes for seven sticks. Well, I'm tempted to just start a fire right here and uh, break all these down. That'd be a lot of fuel. I think I'll pass on that for right now. All right, let's see. How am I doing on sticks? Oh, yeah. I've already got almost enough. All right, we're going to be fine. And what I'll probably do here is go back to the cave. Um, get the fire... We can uh, get some tea, get warmed up, and then I'll carry a torch and um, explore in the other direction. Uh, I thought that was something I might be able to loot there. Alright, are these something I can break down? Does it, oh, maybe it is. Ooh, requires hatchet to break that down. Let's be a different type of scrub brush. I think that's a deer that I hear over that way. All right, where is that cave? Hopefully I didn't get turned around. Um, should be on the right up here somewhere. I'm going to take the fact that I don't see any sticks on the ground around here as a good sign. Hoping that means that I already collected those. Alright, here are the rabbits. So this should be the cave up here. Yeah, I should probably uh, get the rabbits too. Uh, 
All right, let's see. Only feels like negative two. Um, ooh, only 55% chance to start this. Well, that's not ideal, but I think that's the best we can do. Come on, little fire. This is going to be unpleasant if I waste most of my matches on this. I don't really have a choice right now. Come on, little fire. Come on. My thoughts exactly. Perfect. All right, let's throw all these sticks on here. Uh, let me make sure I'm not crazy. I do have a bedroll. I can go ahead and get some water going on here. Just make sure I scouted the rest of this cave out. All right, four torches should be enough. Uh, let's go ahead and grab this one. Oh, that one's kind of bad. All right, I definitely want to go get some more fuel. Uh, let's get warmed up a little bit. I'll craft a one tea ingredient. And actually, I see the rabbits out there right now. Uh, let me just put this out. I think I have enough stones. Three stones. Are there any more sitting around here somewhere? Oh, he turned around. Oh, this rabbit isn't moving. Let's see if I can uh, get him. Let's see if I can find this other one. Be good to go ahead and grab both of them. Now, I'm not going to harvest the skins. Um, unless I really just need to kill time. I don't think I want to make teas tonight. So. Well, that water's going. Let's head back out here and see if we can get some more sticks. And then what I'll do is I'll come back and I'll just, um warm up by the fire while I harvest that meat. Hello? Thought I heard something. A little spooky out here. Alright, well that's probably another couple hours on the fire.
Aha. There's a wolf. Alright, well, I think what I'm going to do is go back to my fire. Um, and then he's going to follow us all the way there, but we should be able to scare him off. Possible. I sort of hide over here that he won't be able to find me. Now he's following me in. All right. Well, when he gets close to the fire, I'll just toss this torch at him. I uh, should be able to scare him off that way. <laughs> that didn't work. Um, maybe it did. It does seem that he gave up. Alright, five minutes until that's done. Uh, let's go ahead and throw the rest of these sticks on here. Yeah, it seems that I'm not going to be able to get a full night's sleep tonight. I'm just not going to be able to get enough fuel for this fire. Um, that's fine, though. Even if I just sleep for six or seven hours, that'll be good enough. I'll just have to really work at finding more fuel tomorrow. Okay, let's see if I can sneak past this wolf. Oh, he's right here. Well, we might be trapped in here for a while. Unfortunate. Yeah. Well, that didn't get close enough to him. He ran off before I threw that, actually. That's weird. Well, kind of wasting time here. What do I want to do? Still have to harvest the rabbits, but I'd rather do that when I'm cold. All right, I think what I'm going to do is try to get past him. And if he's following me while I gather sticks, that's okay. All right, let's see if we can sneak around this way. Okay, he realized I'm here. Let's head up on the other side of this hill. What am I hearing? Oh, there's a deer. You know what? Where did he take that deer out? I want that deer.
Come on, where are you? Right there. Oh. I didn't even have to throw it. Alright, so this is my deer now. Uh, we will get this in the morning, though. Nine kilograms of meat on there. I think he's still running from me. Not anymore. Alright, let's just refresh this. Need to get back to my cave. Been out too long. Ah, there's a bear down there. So I did hear something other than the deer. Oh, that's probably why the deer ran up towards us. Just trying to get away from the bear. Alright, let's see if I can sneak down this way. There's a body here. Ooh, there's a hunting knife there. Alright, I'm gonna come back and get that later. Although, that would allow me to harvest that rabbit meat more quickly. Um, Alright, let's sneak down here. Don't really like the spot I found myself in, but we'll see if we can sneak down this... My fingers feel numb. My water is probably going to boil off. Been out here really long. But as long as I'm here and the wolf isn't on me, we're going to go ahead and grab these cattails. Now oh, this wolf is just plaguing me. It's too cold. I can't decide. I think I'm just going to go back and sleep. We'll go get the knife in the morning. I'm already not going to be able to sleep for the full amount, and it's the middle of the night. It'll be light when I get up. Yeah, this is the right thing to do. Alright, all the sticks on there. If I want to sleep for longer, I could go ahead and burn the coal. I don't think I need to save the coal for emergencies. Now, let's just go ahead and run that over there. Okay, that scared him off. Yeah, I guess I'll be safe. I'll go ahead and throw the coal on there. My water boiled off, unfortunately. Not too surprising. And let's see, with all that deer, I'm not going to have any trouble staying well fed, so let's just go ahead and eat a bunch um, before we sleep here. I'll save uh, probably five cattails. Yeah, 
And actually, what I'm going to do is... Um, I don't need to sleep for that long to fully heal. So I think I'll just sleep for seven hours. And then we'll figure out... Based on what's left on the fire in the morning, we'll make a plan. Sounds like it got pretty windy in the night. All right, well, here we are. It's very early morning. Oh, I didn't get any um, additional duration on this campfire. Well, I wasn't expecting that. I'm glad that I didn't sleep um, any longer than that. Well, I think this is a good start. We've got a knife waiting for us out there. We've got a bunch of meat... Um, and I'm looking forward to exploring the rest of the zone. Um, I hope you enjoyed this one. Thanks for watching.